Hi everyone, Joe Levine here, professional photographer and educator. When I set out to capture the macro image of these wildflowers, I knew I was gonna need a lot of precise control from the camera work, the subject and set, and also all the different lighting. I have a 105 macro lens with an extension tube that gets me roughly two to one. I'm using a geared head on the tripod so I can tilt it down or up and also rotate it side to side, which is really helpful. With the subject and the background, I wanted the ability to move them both independently of each other and also as a group. So with the hero subject, it's in a test tube filled with water and the grip setup allows me to move it forward, back, right, up, down, whatever I'd like and similar to the background flowers. However, because I built it on a single breadboard, I can move it back, in, left and right or even up and down. I wanted something similar with the lighting and all the different reflectors. So each one is built on a single breadboard with a post going up, a grip head with an arm that goes across, and sometimes a second grip head. And I can move those in or out, up and down, really allows me to put light exactly where I want it, which is important for all images, especially macro images. So let's fine tune and see what we have.